like a, a live classroom because um, students can ask questions at any time. Um, I'm constantly watching the chat box if they have questions. Of course, I always have the ability to grab the mic as well to speak. And um, what I've noticed with teaching online is that the shy students, the students that normally don't speak up in a normal classroom environment, they feel a little bit bolder and open to be able to ask questions because maybe they're hiding behind the computer. So, you know, I, you can get just about any question, even if someone needs you to back up on a topic. Um, I like to pause. Does everyone understand what we're going over? Do you know where, I, where, where we are? Because unfortunately, I can't see their faces. And to see, you know, are, are they following me or not? So I might pause. And is everyone following me? Does anyone need me to, you know, go over anything? So it's very much similar to a live classroom where you need to um, make sure the students are with you. Are they answering your questions? Because that's another way I can gauge if the students are following me or not. Uh, can they answer my questions? Um, do they understand the material? Probably the biggest challenge is that students have a lot of material to cover. And um, sometimes I worry a little bit about the students who work 40 hours plus a week. I mean, I have advisees who are doing it just fine. They're the top of the class right now. But I think their biggest challenge is that they're trying to balance family life, uh, work life, and then trying to learn a lot of, of new material in two years, those, those basic sciences. So there's, there's a lot of material, but now these more mature, older students, you know, they do have their families, understandably, and some of them I understand that they need to have their jobs. And so I think time management is, is really important as well. I think the advantage with the OUM students, though, that I like is that they're more mature and they're more, they're more motivated. They know that's what they want to do. And they're more motivated, and I think that probably comes to, with students that have worked before, and now they're thinking about, you know, going back to school.